GP the Tool Addict. Woo! We got ourselves Dan Steyer here doing some RBRT vit videos. He's I got I got my RBRT bits. That's right. I got mine right here. Look at that lineup. But Dan, he's gonna show us some good stuff. He was nice enough, kind enough to take some time out of his day. Want you guys to really enjoy this. Hopefully you get some more information out of these RBRT bit videos. I definitely appreciate you guys watching. Definitely think you guys are great subscribers and uh, appreciate everything that you guys do for the channel. So stick around, stay tuned, and get ready. We're going to have the video right now. Come on. the box of our seven piece extractors and it goes from number one to number seven and there's a drill bit index on the box here to take the guesswork out of what drill bit to use just use that size drill bit with that size extractor so once you've made your choice you know what drill bit to use drill your hole and that's our for broken bolt extractor so that's what you want to reach for when you get to the point nothing else is working then you grab your for extractors cool. now we also have a set of long extractors that does not have the sleeve so that if you need to get down into a hole or if you're doing some bench work these ones here are real nice now there's no foreign object removal sleeve on there so sometimes it can be a little challenging to get that separated off because these right. things bite better than any other extractor on the planet nothing right. else bites like the uh, rbrt extractor does i know that cp's used them in the past pretty successfully yeah. right yeah yeah they are they are definitely something that you want to use when you're getting <laughs> into the really nasty stuff. So, And then I brought this nice little set. This is our stubby hex, both standard and metric. So 3 8 one eighth to 3 eighths and 4 millimeter to 12. And guys, the nice little one-piece machine design. Yeah. Beautifully machined. Impact? Yeah, no, no not impact rated. Okay. And it says right on the box, not, oh, not for impact for use. Okay. You want to use this one with a, with a, with a ratchet. And the reason for that, guys, is we do have impact versions of RBRT, 
and the the heads of the impact version are a little less aggressive okay. so it makes up for the thump right these are for an incremental increase in torque as you get on the ratchet the rbrt stuff does the job but if you put that on an impact you can chew stuff up with it because right. it's so aggressive right? right and that thump that's not but the but the impact ones are designed for that so there's definitely a spot in the toolbox for both impact and for regular but this set here has that 11 millimeter that the Chrysler guys with the caliper bolts have trouble with, I know. Uh, and yes. it's perfect for yes. those, right? I mean, I yes. know you've experienced yes. that personally. Yeah, you Chrysler guys, that's the one. You guys know about them Chrysler caliper bolts. I use the T50 Torx. Me and Dan were talking about this earlier. I used the T50 Torx and I didn't even realize that that 11 millimeter was actually the one that's the true fit for that. Right. And I know some of the Chrysler guys, there's you know a few of you guys out there, are gonna be like, oh, okay. I've heard that they actually come from the factory stripped because yes. the machines that put them together actually yes. strip the hex at the factory. Yes. So that's the tool you wanna use yes. for those, but that's the uh, the stubby hex. And that's a fairly new set, just come up on the market this year and they're really, really nice. So there we go. And then the, the last one I wanna show you is our, one of the sets that we started with. This is our most popular seller. It's the mid-length hex. 4 to 10 millimeter and 8 to 3 eighths in mid-length design. I like the length a, a little bit, The you know, when you got to get down into a hole or you're yeah. set back a little bit from what you're trying to get at. Um, and yeah, that has a, been our most popular that's a, that's set a, there. That's a really nice set, guys. I, I actually don't have that set. I didn't realize I didn't have that set. Didn't even realize I had that set. But that uh, that covers all your sizes there for mo for the most part. Pretty much. For, for automotive general. world, yeah. Yeah, automotive world. That's what you want to get right there. Definitely, I, I'm a proprietor of having four, four of these sets right off the bat. The... FOR extractors, your torques. Uh, I don't know. There, there's so many of them. I, I, I want to buy all of them. Yeah, we got, we got the uh, 13 piece, the quarter inch set. I know CP has shown you this in the past, but this is actually my most favorite set. He owns this set. This is the set that you started off yes, with, CP, this set, right? This is what got me into RBRT bits. I had a match going to, and I had a bolt that was stripped out of my gun, stopped onto the Mack truck. Asked him what he had, and he said, have you tried the RBRT bits? We did it right there on the truck. Took out a mag button out of my gun that I couldn't get out, and I'd been fighting this thing for a couple days. Would have cost me $100, probably not, uh, probably made me not do well at the match. I ended up taking second place awesome. at the match. So, awesome. uh, you know, that building that confidence. It's almost the same thing when you're working on cars, though. You know in order true. for that car to leave and you to feel confident about it, you got to have the right tool for the right job. Right, and now... The reason why this set, and, and I'm, not, I'm not a tech. I was a Mac guy for a long time, so I've been in the tool industry many, many years, and I have tool background experience. But I use this at home all the time because how many times do you come across yeah. something that's got those little cheap hex head fasteners that just, you look at it and it's stripped out, and these are just perfect for the house. So guys, that's the 17 piece set for the house. Let me show you one thing real quick here. These, these guys right here, your knife, how many times is your clips? Yeah. Your pocket clip loosen up on your knife, your pocket knife right here, guys. That's it. It's, it's the greatest <laughs> little set to have around. You know. And I want to show you the part number. There's the part number to that 17 piece set. Now you can get, if you don't have a Mac guy, don't worry. You can go on MacTools.com and just in the upper right hand corner, there's a little search bar. Put in RBRT and it brings up all the possibilities for RBRT. They make it really easy for you to buy it online if you don't have a Mac guy. And their return process for warranties is really simple, absolutely, really easy. Absolutely. I mean, you can call them up and they'll give you a shipping label and you can ship that stuff in and, uh, you know, get your tool back within a couple of weeks from what I understand. They're really quick yeah. about it. But, uh, yeah, you know, a couple if, days in some cases. In some, right? Yeah. Right. So if you if you but if you do have a Mac guy, I would suggest picking one of these up for They're the house. The 17-piece quarter set's fantastic. I would not go without it. <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's what we got, guys. Uh, we'll have uh, another video coming up here. Uh, Dan will do another video with us. But I uh, appreciate you guys watching. Remember, like, comment, share, subscribe, ring that bell. We'll catch you on the next one. Keep your hands dirty and your money clean. Thank you. I appreciate you guys watching so much. I hope you enjoyed that video. Let me know down in the comment box. Bing, bing, bing. You know, hit that bleep blooper down there. <laughs> and uh, let me know in the comment box if you enjoyed this video. Did things a little different. I did a little bit of editing. 
tried to throw a little bit of, you know, fun in there and, and whatnot, a little music, this and that. But anyways, guys, remember, like, comment, share, subscribe, ring that bell. And uh, remember, keep your hands dirty and your money clean. Thanks for watching. See you later.